strong. Welcome to the Philippines Raptors, for the first time in history, two F-22 Raptor stealth fighter aircraft from the United States Air Force landed at Clark Air Base, Philippines yesterday. Two of the United States Air Force's USAF premier stealth fighter aircraft, the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor, along with its Boeing KC-135 Stratotanker aircraft, landed and visited Clark Air Base, Pampanga for a so-called bilateral fighter subject matter expert exchange SME, on march 13. in a statement wednesday philippine air force paf spokesperson colonel ma consuelo castillo said the bilateral fighter SME is part of the air force's mutual defense board security engagement board mdb seb activities for 2023. it remains to be seen whether its presence has anything to do with the ongoing joint exercises with the armed forces of the united states or whether this is one of the united states strategies for the philippines to be interested in continuing talks to acquire 12 units of lockheed martin f-16 block 70 viper fighters we received word from several sources that the push forward on the enhanced defense cooperation agreement edca between the U.S. and Philippine Defense Departments has bolstered efforts to gain support and influence to support the selection of the Lockheed Martin F-16 Block 70 Viper. The EDCA is said to help make it easier for the U.S. to support F-16 operations and sustainment of the Philippines since it is their country's product and their supply chain supports F-16s and its subsystems. The U.S. cannot provide any support for the JAS-39 Gripam except for emergency requirements for ammunition since the Gripen is not in service with the U.S. military and has subsystems that are not even in the U.S. military supply chains.